I'm look at the that. holy it's crap! So it's so different. It's so much more open. Yo, there's so much potential for this, man. There's so much we could do here. This is the nicest piece of land in the city now, right here. Right here, guys. Yeah, my tire, my tire is pretty terrible too, man. Well, they're like so-so. Yours don't look so bad, actually. No, mine are like flat. Mine are pretty bad. I couldn't even jump the uh, bridge. Where are we going to fill them up? Total Psycho Rig 3. All right. On Hitch Street. Hopefully it doesn't... They're moving, eh? They're moving to a new, new location. Oh, uh, yeah. Everybody's moving these days. Let's hope it doesn't... Music Melody. Oh, like Bicycle World was? No, Bicycle World... No, where Bicycle World was? Now there's a popcorn. Happy popcorn. Oh my god, that's a lot of... That's a lot of space to make popcorn, man. And, and now they're building a sushi. Sushi and ramen place. Are you sure about all this or is it all like rumors? No, 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 they have the signs. Oh, really? Happy popcorn is already in there. I've never been to Happy Popcorn Company. That is the place to go. For popcorn? It's way better than Cineplex popcorn. It tastes That's rich. That's a pretty high bar, man. We'll no, see. No, it is. We'll see. It's in Bicycle World now? Uh, no, they added three. Like, they divided it by three. Okay, yeah, because that place is huge. Yeah, that's huge. That would be impossible. That's where Bicycle World used to be, and now it's like three different stores. There was a lot of room in there, so I could see why they did that. The Crystal's Cauldron? That looks pretty cool. Let's cross. I want to see. Oh, it's like uh, rocks and spiritual things. Really? Yeah, yeah. It's like the rocks. Oh, yeah. They got a bunch of... Spiritual. Spiritual stuff. Man, Actually, these things are getting more and more popular. Yeah, there's another one in town. There's one in the east on end there. On 10th Street. 10th Street over there. Yeah, there's a couple of them. Yo, check it, man. They're building over there. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I wonder what they're going to be doing. Dude, that's going to be like the tightest place to be in the city. Yo, that was nothing for like... 10 years. 10 years. I was going to say 100 years. Because <laughs> I used to hang out there and play uh, skateboard and stuff. Oh, nice, man. Yeah, you would. There we go. Now we're rolling. Look at this. No, we're unstoppable now. All terrain. Whoa. Auto sterile tile. Uh, no. I guess it's garbage. We should bring it to a pharmacy. That would be the responsible true, thing to do. True. Because any crazy guy could take it out of the garbage. You know what I mean? I'm gonna see right over there too. So. Oops. Don't know what else to do with it. Just like that. What? Yeah. Yo, it's Dan or Bill. Bill. Nice. Hello. Famous radio talk show host. One of two, Bill, Dan and Bill. Uh, that was Bill. You know 1019? Yes, I do. Yeah, boom, baby. This here is an escape room, yeah, but it, I think, no, nah, it used to be a jail. Well, it used to be a jail in the nine, no, 19, yeah, 19 or two, 2000s. I guess. It got too haunted. That's what happened. Lemonwood Park just over here. One of the nicest play structures in town. Probably the nicest play structures in town. And then, and then there's a workout place. Oh, that's right. There's a workout place too. We'll show you guys soon. We always forget water, man. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Oops. Look at this guy. Yo, how much you think it sold for? At least 3000 I would say. 300000 Yeah, 300000 That's what I meant to say. Since we're this far, would you like to go for some ice cream? I mean, we're in the neighborhood. Like, instead of getting water, might as well have some ice cream. Yeah, why not? I will work out. And from the best shopping town. Yeah. Old dump tar chimneys. All that's left.
Yeah, that's bad. Eh? It's kind of like throwing, like leaving your dirty. Delivering your, your own place. I know, right? It's not cool. It's pretty cheap for two scoops. Yeah, eh? For something? It's pretty good. It was perfect. No! No, oh, man, what? Can I have some of yours? No. <laughs> Whatever, man. It was too much, anyways. You're like, it's too much. <laughs> you drop it. Fucking falls, man. Not fair. Whatever. <laughs> uh, oh, well, you were just complaining. You were just saying, ah, uh, this is too much. I won't finish it. I'm going to get them to row it out anyway. Yeah, somebody heard me. Whatever. I'm worried about the sound quality for the, uh, for the video because it's very windy and I don't really have a good mic, so. If the sound is bad, bear with us, please. Sorry about that. Just a beautiful Wednesday afternoon, biking around Cornwall. Trying to avoid traffic. The works of architects such as this church. Oh, shit, my hat. This is the place you were talking about, eh? Yes. Tiny tape. A secret jam restaurant. It is really good, man. The best faux soup in town. Oh, wow. Thanks for running over my hat, by the way. <laughs> now we're on Sydney Street, where probably the nicest houses in Cornwall are. Uh, probably the oldest houses, too. Check out these castles, man. Beautiful. And this is Cornwall's beautiful, wonderful library. Very, actually, very nice for Cornwall. It's probably one of the nicer libraries I've been in, but I haven't been in a lot of libraries, just this one, so let's be very biased. Very peculiar graffiti. Just getting out of the wind. Where do you want to go to now? I mean, we're just kind of showing you guys Cornwall, so that's... I'm just giving you an eye of Cornwall, things that you don't really see. And you don't notice in town. If you're not biking around town, you know. Yeah. You're driving all day, every day, you won't see half of the city. Yeah, and we're kind of not want to show it. Like, we don't want to videotape inside of stores because it's not really polite sometimes. But anyhow, whatever. I mean, they don't allow it in most places. Oh, you go with the flow. It's actually pretty cool. It is, it is. Yeah, we're going to get some food. We're going to go to Loose Caboose, which is all the way down this road over here. Everything's nearby. Everything's That's really close. That's what I like about Cornwall. Yeah, it's so you, you can... You don't need to like drive to everything. Big cities, you always have to drive 10, 20 minutes to just move to one little place. Here you can just bike around, walk around. It's really close by to everything. <laughs> Yo, just a small fry. Just a small fry. Now we are in Le Village, as they call it, Montreal Road. One of the older roads in Cornwall, I think. I don't know. We're getting pretty tired, so... Man, what a beautiful afternoon. So happy you guys can join us. It's important to get out, you know? The summer's around the corner. There you go, right? I think it's gonna be a good summer.